This is a series of pictures of a marten trying to catch a bug. I think it actually failed, as near as I can tell. I never saw anything enter the marten's mouth. But notice the foot, how the foot was extended up near the mouth and then gets retracted in. It's still extended there, I believe, and now instantly it got retracted. You can still see it above the feathers. Um, it's really strange. These photographs are one-seventh of a second apart. So that foot moved from all the way forward to all the way back in just a split second. Now watch its head turn, too. Its head will turn in just one-seventh of a second from left to all the way over to the other side. Like that. That was one seventh of a second there. Now I'm going to zoom in on the head part. I apologize for the poor quality of the video, but that's the first shot I got with the head, the mouth wide open, and the foot up there as if to rake the food into its mouth. Or maybe that was for other aerodynamic purposes, like you push, you flail one arm in a swimming pool when you're trying to turn around or something. I don't know. And it looks like something might be in the mouth, but I think that's probably the tongue. Uh, this, uh, I think this is uh, an adult female. Certainly she caught no dragonfly. And on the full-size images where the bird itself is just about one-tenth the image size or one-twentieth the image size of the whole frame, um, I looked ahead into the blue sky and I could not ever see anything that looked like a bug. So this must have been just a, uh, a failed attempt, or maybe she just had an itch up there by her right cheek and she wanted to scratch it and there was kind of a Babinski effect with the mouth opening. I don't know. You be the judge.